free remake. We are nearing the end. Not not really, but yes. Uh, so I believe this is the last time we play as Carlos, and it is, uh, excuse me, awesome. Uh, we are, you know, defending Jill against the hordes of infinite waves of zombies. So there you go. <laughs> uh, I kind of wish I had more weapons. <laughs> I really want a shotgun. Um, uh, I, I really don't want to use the coins. I really don't want to use the coins. <laughs> Uh, but I really do. I really want to use them, like, like the the defense coin. But you know, it, it'd be too easy. I just wish I had more healing items. Okay. Oh wait. Oh, oh yeah, I do need to heal. Uh, cause I think one bite is going to kill me. It's horrible. Um. Ugh. I feel dirty. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Should have done it earlier. I'll try hacking into the hospital security system. Keep them off me in the meantime. Oh yeah, I died last time because I didn't know where the circuit breaker was. I'm gonna need this. Okay, now the fun shit. Shit, die, bitch. How the hell did they breach the roof? There's a wall in front of your door, buddy. I'm doing terrible. Are you serious? That's okay. That's totally fine. It's probably best that I died. I I, I was doing horrible. Uh, my aim was bad. So, you know what? That's good. That's good. Great way to start. Just immediately die. <laughs> I wonder how many bites I can take with one defense coin. <laughs> I really want to take a defense coin. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's okay though. Uh, I think what I'll do. Oh. Wow. Uh, I think what I'll do is uh, I'll beat this and then I'll save it and then I'll play it again with a defense coin because I'm just really curious. Yeah, they don't actually, like, stop coming through the window, uh, even if they're dead. So I don't want to shoot them as they're coming through the window. Because you don't know when they actually die. Damn! That was close. Oh! 
Oh fuck, no ammo. Reload! I think I'll make a separate video on it because not everybody watches my playthrough. But, uh, so all of you who are watching, you get to answer this question early. What's your favorite part of Resident Evil 3? Like, you know, like what's your favorite stage? Like, like your favorite battle, or your favorite like scenario in Resident Evil 3? And do you have much better aim than I do? Still don't know where the breaker is. Still don't know where the breaker is. Wow. Are you s Was that actually the breaker? Was... Was that... Okay, so okay. I'll find out. But was that tiny little light switch the breaker for the motel? I'm sorry. The hospital? Because uh, I live and work in a motel, uh, and I know what a fucking breaker looks like, and that is not what a breaker looks like. Wow. It's throwing me off hardcore. <laughs> Like, that is, it, that is a light switch, sir. That, it, it, <laughs> if just a tiny little light switch was a real breaker for, uh, for like half the building, uh, with no protection on it whatsoever, it would be going off all the time because people wouldn't even know what it did. It's <laughs> Man, I know you guys are in Japan when you made this game, but it's, come on, man. <laughs> We're not that different. Shit, buddy. I have flashbangs? When did, when did I get flashbangs? Fucking die. Not dead. No, he's dead. your favorite part of this thing. Uh, I would say the entire hospital uh, is my favorite part. It's, uh, uh, I just love hospitals. Uh, I like the smell of hospitals. My nose doesn't work very well, but I can... Uh, depending on the hospital, I guess. Uh, it just, you know, like has that overwhelming smell of... Uh, Um, peroxide, yeah. Yeah. It's just a pleasant smell. Oh my gosh, I was trying to fucking shoulder bash his ass. Now I'm almost dead. Get wrecked. Oh, 
Oh shit. I'm getting wrecked. Flashback. I didn't need to do that. Could have just used that. Don't worry. I just turned on the breaker. Fucking reload your fucking gun, dipshit! Ah! I need him to throw another flashback. This is it! This is it! So What the hell? Fucking parasite. Oh crap. I don't even mean that in the uh, insult way. That is actually what There need to be more parasites. There's not a lot of them. You rarely ever see them, and they're like, you know, one of the scariest, strongest enemies. Fuck! No, you fucking piece of shit! grenades um, I I know I have a detonator but that's actually for like like the end of it I think because uh, I saw some C4 on one of the pillars you just use it on the pillar uh, but I can't actually like use it right now I think oh I'm still here <laughs> I'm still here Are there any more grenades? Okay. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Okay. Yeah, because I can't now actually use it right there. Dude. Oh my god! Dude! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Dude. I wish normal zombies uh, in resistance would dodge. I mean, uh, the Jester is like the only one that does it.
Oh, an un un normal grenade. Hell yeah. Okay. Boom. Come on, man, throw the fucking flashy. Flashbang. There's a nem there's a parasite right there. Doing good, doing good. Whoa, whoa! Close. But at least it's over. I'm coming back. <sighs> Vaccine's a real deal. Good. You going somewhere? You damn right. So it's been about like 20 you minutes. Oh, Holy city's crap, about man. To be microwaved. Come on, man. Call the government. Tell them we found a cure. You stall for time. Motherfucker. Yeah. I'm sure I can cut some of this out.
yeah, finally, you know, came to fruition, and she has another nightmare about it. It. it... I've got good news. It's over now. The city's safe. She wakes up from nightmares gracefully, like, oh, um, that was terrifying. Gosh, woman, <laughs> does nothing phase you? Good seeing that shotgun again. <laughs> do I start at full health? Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, I uh, I have a full arsenal here. Wow. Oh wow. Uh, oh yeah, because this was like right after I fought Nemesis, uh, and I picked everything back up. Um, I don't need these. Uh, I will need them later. Uh, don't need that. Oh, I might need them against the Pale Heads. But I don't think I'm facing them right now, am I? No. No, not yet. Um, and I think everything else is fine. Let's organize this a little bit. Ooh, the hot dogger. Yeah, yeah, I need the hot dogger back. Um, let's move this up there. There we go. Okay. I probably need the lockpick, so let's get that back out. And switch this to down. Boom. Oh. Oh, shit. Wait. Oh, so that's Carlos's gun. The G18 first model. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. So, yeah. So, Carlos's G18 is the one without the burst fire, but this is the burst fire. Wow. Okay, three round burst. Quick fire, a lot of damage in a short time. Mm, I don't know which is better though. You unlock this one. Excellent. Exceptional accuracy and firepower. Uh, let's just, you know, try this one out. How many shots it takes. Should probably save. Okay, that was this one. Let's go this one. Okay. Morning, sunshine. You saved my life. I sure as shit didn't. That was all Carlos. He carried you here and he treated you himself. Crazy bastard. Crazy bastard. Crazy. <laughs> we went underground. Bard stockpiled the vaccine enough to give the city some hope. He thinks he can do this by himself. I'm going after him. Wait, did you see the broadcast? They're gonna blow the city sky high. I'm trying to get a hold of someone, anyone with the clearance to stop it. Leave this mess to him. He's a professional. So am I. Right. Guess I'm not talking you out of this. The storage facility is underground, beneath this hospital. I've lost contact with Carlos, so expect trouble. So you're telling me that... 
so that your buddy went into an underground secret research facility that creates mutant monsters and zombies all alone. You lost contact with them. But then you're telling me everything is okay and I don't need to go down there and help him because everything is perfectly fine. This disaster is about to go over because you're trying to tell someone to make it in. And now you're telling me to expect trouble. Which the fuck is it, man? Take a shower. He is bleeding all over the place. That poor bastard. I hope he's okay. I mean, he really looks like he got bit. Wait, wh where am I going? <laughs> oh, I forgot. All that stuff that I said Jill was going to do. Now I'm doing it. Yeah, that's going to take a lot longer than half. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's going to take a lot longer than five minutes. Okay. Let's try out this new gun. Ooh. Okay. Oh, there, there's a hunter in here. So we're gonna make our way upstairs, and then we're gonna save, and then I'll end the episode. Cause, uh, it's hard to kinda gauge, uh, after I died so many times. Oh, what's that, what's that, what's that? Hell yeah, I knew bringing the lockpick was the right choice. Ooh, sweet. Oh, I don't have enough room. You know what? I'm gonna put the burst handgun away. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna put the burst handgun away. And then I'm gonna look it up. Uh, I'm gonna see which one's more efficient. Like when it comes to damage. Because it uses uh, a lot of ammo. I mean, it was basically, what, eight shots? I'm pretty sure I can do uh, a lot more damage in fewer shots with the Samurai Edge. Where's that hunter? It chased me all the way over here, man. So what, do all the hunters just disappear? It says I missed something in here. What did I possibly miss? Oh. Okay. This looks like Nikolai's work. Oh. Nice. I don't remember her saying that voice line. Cool. I guess I've never been in there after that. <laughs> there it is. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. And... Uh, gosh, after seeing that, uh... Yeah, hunters would just be cannon fodder, just like the liquors. Uh, and you guys said it, too. Uh, and I knew that, but I didn't, like, really know that because I wasn't using a shotgun against them, but it's sad. It was completely useless just because of a shotgun. But, but it's supposed to be like that, that, that the shotgun is a powerful weapon. It's supposed to be. Oh, there's another one right there. But even after the nerfs of the ammo, it's still the most popular weapon because it's still, you know. 
Uh, they didn't fix the resource problem with survivors. I have a grenade. I have three grenades, so I might be able to... I think I can squeeze by. Ooh, that's actually hard to look at with a hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And this is the area that only Jill can access. Just because she's smaller. And there's the lightning honk. Oh. This is a good looking magnum. Guaranteed to give you a headache. I just don't like how it looks in resistance because it's fully upgraded with a scope and everything and uh, just adding a scope onto a pistol just looks ugh. I mean, some people like it because it uh, uh, it helps with accuracy, obviously. I just don't like how it makes it look. It just it's just ugh. Oh yeah, I forgot to save. Okay, uh, so I guess I'm gonna save and then we'll uh, I will be done for this episode. <laughs> oh gosh. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed, uh, mostly me dying the entire episode. <laughs> uh, I'm glad I finally got past that part. Uh, so my favorite part is the hospital. Uh, it, uh, it's the most engaging. Uh, it has hunters, it has waves of enemies, it's, you know, difficult. Um, uh, but what's yours? Yeah, uh, just let me know down below. Uh, favorite boss battle with Nemesis, uh, favorite part of the game, and uh, yeah, that's all. Anyway, if you enjoyed, please press that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and as always, have a great day.